Does intermittent fasting lower cholesterol? Yep, this is the topic of this weight loss video. Welcome back to Bubble Ox channel where we answer pressing weight loss question. If you have not subscribed yet, please hit subscribe and like this video. Number 1. So what is intermittent fasting? Intermittent fasting is an eating pattern which is related to fasting periods and eating. In humans, fasting is achieved by taking no or little amount of food. Intermittent fasting is a method in which people can do fasting from 16 hours to 24 hours that is done for twice a week. People are using this method to improve their health and also to lose weight. During fasting periods, you can eat either little food or nothing at all. There are two common methods of doing intermittent fasting. Method 1. Eat Stop Eat. This method involves fasting for 24 hours and you do not eat anything in fasting period. You can do it once or twice a week. Method 2. 5-2 Method. In this method of intermittent fasting, you can get only 500 to 600 calories on two non-consecutive days of the week. On the other five days, you can eat normally. Now that you understand the concept of intermittent fasting, let's move on to the next topic. Number 2. How Cholesterol Works. Cholesterol is a fat-like waxy substance that is formed by the liver. Dot. It helps the body to make different hormones, vitamin D and membrane of cells. Cholesterol also gets from the food that's why its level increases in the body which leads to risk of many diseases related to the heart. When cholesterol level increases, it starts to deposit on the walls of the arteries. It makes it difficult for blood to pass through the arteries. Deposition of cholesterol in the arteries can also lead to formation of clots in blood arteries that cause heart attack or stroke. Number 3. High Cholesterol Causes Unhealthy Lifestyle The main cause of high cholesterol is an unhealthy lifestyle. Too much consumption of oily foods can cause high levels of cholesterol in the body. Cholesterol passes through the body by lipoprotein. There are two types of lipoprotein namely, HDL and LDL. HDL or high-density lipoprotein is also known as good cholesterol. It has beneficial effects on the body and reduces the risk of heart diseases. HDL absorbs the cholesterol from the body and takes back to the liver. Then the liver removes it from the body and helps to lower the risk of coronary heart diseases. Another is LDL or low-density lipoprotein, also known as bad cholesterol. Most of the body cholesterol consists of LDL but a high level of LDL causes heart diseases, coronary arteries disease, peripheral arteries disease, heart attack or strokes. Number 4. Health Benefits of Intermittent Fasting Intermittent fasting has many benefits on health. It can lower the cholesterol and also weight of the body. On intermittent fasting days, high caloric foods are restricted. High caloric food makes more cholesterol in the body that has bad effects. So, high caloric foods are not consumed during intermittent fasting. Research shows that intermittent fasting can lower the LDL level in the body which helps to prevent heart diseases such as heart attack and atherosclerosis. Fasting helps to break the fats of the body. It also reduces the deposition of cholesterol from the arteries that can normalize the blood flow through the arteries. Therefore, fasting can help to lower the coronary heart disease and also stroke. Intermittent fasting is helpful to reduce cardiovascular diseases. LDL level decreases in the bloodstream that helps to improve the flow of blood in the arteries. So, intermittent fasting prevents chronic heart disease such as heart attack and atherosclerosis. It can also prevent arteries from clot formation in it. During intermittent fasting, LDL is destroyed by the liver and removed from the body which is beneficial to prevent clot formation in arteries. Intermittent fasting may help to improve cholesterol level in humans but it is important to consider the duration, weight loss and gender. Number 4. Does intermittent fasting really lower cholesterol? If we compare the pre- and post-intermittent fasting period then it shows that HDL level increases while LDL level decreases. Moreover, total cholesterol level and triglyceride level also decreases by intermittent fasting. The increase in tumor necrosis factor alpha, TNF-alpha, is also associated with high cholesterol. TNF-alpha is an inflammatory cytokine which is produced during acute inflammation. By intermittent fasting, 
TNF-alpha level decreases which help to improve the lipid profile and lowering the cholesterol level. To conclude, intermittent fasting is a popular method in the health and fitness community. Intermittent fasting can help to reduce the weight loss and also prevent the body from cardiovascular diseases. Cholesterol level is also reduced by intermittent fasting. It can help to reduce LDL level and increase HDL level in the bloodstream. Mostly, cholesterol level changes with the weight loss. Intermittent fasting is the dietary method which is used to improve the cholesterol level in dyslipidemic, healthy and obese people. There you go, beside answering the main question of whether intermittent fasting can lower cholesterol, you have already seen other health benefits of performing this activity. Thank you for watching until the end, remember to subscribe and like this video, if you find value in it. See you in the next video on Bubble Ox channel.